sir. Stopped off at the one and only Mackey's on the way to, um, well actually I'm not going to say where I'm going because obviously this is going to be in the same video that I buy it. I'm not buying the car today. I'm not buying the car today but I am leaving a fat deposit on it and then I'm going back to buy it on the 29th of this month so that's just the end of this month. Um, you'll, all, you'll all like the car and don't worry nothing's happening to the Corolla, nothing's happened to the Ibiza. Um, I'm keeping both of them, I'm just having a third car as well. Um, you'll see, it'll all, it'll all work itself out and you'll, you'll all understand once you see the car. I'm going to go see it today and leave a deposit on it and go back on the 29th to pick it up. I think I've said that already. I'm just going to, yeah, let's start the road trip. I'm still at my local Mackey's, I've not actually set off really yet. So, that reminds me. Ignore all the subway wrappers, jeez. Yeah, I need to set up my fern mount and then, because obviously I don't know the way off my top of my head. It's like a two hour drive there, two hour drive back, so pretty decent trip. Right, trying to make sure I don't show his address. I don't think it shows it anywhere on the screen. But it's going to take an hour and 58 minutes, so basically two hours. I'm aiming to get there for about 10ish. So, it reckons I'm going to get there at 9.53. Alright, bet. Let's see when I get there. Oh damn, it just changed. I beat it by about three minutes, but I got stuck behind a fucking Tesco van. You're right here in videos. Yeah. So, this guy, he's got Hello. four Ibizas at his house now. He's got this diesel one that's fucked because the boost pipe's come off it or something. This piece of shit. His uh, 1.8T. And then, this. So this is the one that I'm going to buy. So this is also a 1.8T. And the Amint project. And I can like swap everything over off mine onto it. And it'll be rapid. Didn't see that before. <laughs> see what? <laughs> Scrap my bumper. Have you written something on the back? No. I've got my yeah. So, yeah, I'm coming back on the, well, the end of this month to get this. It's got like limo tints and stuff. Bolt, it's got a new bolt there. Because you can it fell off yeah, a bit. It was literally almost scraping the wheel. Scraping the wheel. Oh nice. You can see my my lowering springs, well my old lowering yeah. springs. I've got yellow ones now. Dude, get these fucking drum brakes out of the way. You can sort of see it. So I had a good look at it, left a deposit on it. That's his, and then mine's behind it. I'm coming back in about two weeks to get it. And now, he's got a straight through exhaust on his 1.8T. So we're off for a drive and he's gonna show me the pop and bang stuff. So, I'm gonna make some noises. So we've come to Mexico. Yep. And then, um, once this car warms up, we're gonna do some poppy bangy noises. Yeah, proper ones. Like better than this one. <laughs> right, so he's gonna show me some noises. Oh fucking hell! You feel it in your chest. You know what I mean? <laughs> Mate, you are making mine do that. <laughs> Straight through exhaust and put that dodgy map on mine. Dodgy, dodgy map. <laughs> That's sick. That's actually mint. I didn't think it would be that loud, I shit myself. Let's make sure it's locked. So we're off for a spin in his 1.8. I'm going back to buy it. I left the deposit, so... Mint. Oh, kitty. Meow. Meow. Oh, look, this button goes. Where are we off? This little rod down there where you can floor it. In Mexico, obviously. <laughs> yeah, we're off to we're Mexico. Live, I live in Mexico. Yeah, Mexico's just round here, isn't it? <laughs> Fucking hell! I've never seen an Ibiza go so quick! <laughs> 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 
<laughs> Genuinely, I have never felt like an Ibiza before. What the fuck? That's crazy. Can't wait to do that every day on my way to work. <laughs> and where's your fuel? Yeah. Hey, it's rapid. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. I was expecting it to be like mine where you hear it before you feel it. <laughs> Get to the back. Yeah. On mine, like I floor it up to four grand and let off, and it'll just bang. <laughs> but it depends. It depends how it's probably mapped. This used to yeah. free before it was mapped. That old thing. What the fuck is that? <laughs> How far away is Mexico? Just that sign there. Oh, Mexico. Mm -hmm. This sign. Yeah, it says Mexico. Yeah. So 40 roughly translated to Mexico. Yeah. Yeah. We're doing 10 mile an hour. Over there. Yeah. Why are we doing 40? Tell them to slow down. What the fuck? <laughs> Your speed will look like an RPM gauge. Push it out the way, right? <laughs> Wheel spin into your house.
this isn't really a muffler. It's not got anything inside it. It's hollow, pretty much. So, yeah. Here's the um, back box. And that's the pipe after the back box. Then I'm going to get the rest of it in the mail soon. Um, but this isn't for my red Ibiza. This is for... Is. <laughs> the cap that goes on the end of my lens. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> so, we swapped the wheels over to these ones, which are the, like the original FR ones, I think. Um, and loads of shit in the boot. Got a free FR, but not FR, like a facelift rear bumper instead of the pre facelift one. So, that's another thing I can fit when I get home. And yeah. Gonna drive home and hopefully not break down. Hopefully not break down. <laughs> yeah, hopefully. Hopefully, yeah. Got insurance, got tax, MOT and all that, so yeah, let's send it. Yeah. Yeah. Kind of. It's kind of. <laughs> right. I will right. see you in a bit. Enjoy. <laughs> Be careful. Yeah. <laughs> see ya. Overheated. 
Um, coolant, coolant leaked out of here and the car overheated. That's just oil from the breather, that's probably nothing to worry about. So I'm going to wait for it to cool down and hopefully set off back home. But this is fucked. <laughs> hopefully I didn't damage anything too much. I really hope it's still alright. Yeah. We check back in. I, I didn't think it, well it wasn't starting for a while. Oh, don't do that again. Figured I'd check in with you guys because I'm bored as fuck in the petrol station. Um, waiting for my dad at the moment. He's going to bring the coolant bottle that's not fucked. And he's also bringing the breather hose because that's non existent on this engine. <laughs> um, so, yeah, I overheated twice basically onto the red of the gauge, which is sick. Um, and the first time. It had that pop and bang map, which you've obviously seen in the dashcam footage, but here you go again. The second time it didn't do that pop and bang thing, I don't know why it did that the first time. Hopefully it's not the head gasket. Probably is the head gasket. We'll fucking find out, won't we? And then it, yeah, after the first time I overheated it, it didn't want to start up. Um, eventually I got it started, it just, I don't know, I was flooring it on the accelerator and it eventually started. Um, Right now it doesn't want to start again either. So we'll wait till my dad gets here. Do the coolant bottle, the breather hose. Maybe the engine will have cooled down a bit more. And hopefully it'll start. Hopefully the next shot you guys see of this camera is this car outside my house. But yeah, I don't know. It's been fun, it's all part of the fun, isn't it? At least I've, uh, I've got a good platform now, even if I do have to get it dragged home. And even if I have to do an engine rebuild on it, head gasket and all that shit, it'll be fun, won't it? <laughs> oh well. Yeah, I'll check in with you guys later on today, when hopefully this thing is at my house. <laughs> 